Hey everybody, this is Elfinator, and welcome back to Let's Play Banjo-Kazooie Part 20. Now that we have all the notes and all the jiggies, let us continue on to the final area of the game. And hey, it has a big face of Tootie, so what- oh, hello. Um, is this Monopoly? <laughs> Banjo-Kazooie version? Welcome all! Granny's the name. I'm not gonna voice act. I'm sorry. Um, Lair is done, and here he stands through all my tricks and traps and lands. This final test will see me win. When Banjo falls, then I will be. Then I'll be thin. The prize on on this stand bring joy from Tootie down to Cuddly Toy. My little quiz will make you sweat. And Tootie, you shall never get. Cause somewhere soon along the way, your lack of skill will make my day. Cause in the fiery pit you'll go, and I will win the prize on show. So step on over to the square, press A, try if you dare. Wow. Uh, that must have been a lot, a lot of writing. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> that must have been a lot of writing on uh, Rareware's part. Anyway, um... That is actually our uh, last uh, cauldron of the game. Uh, well, not the last cauldron, but he'll probably be a part of the last uh, uh, set that we will look for. And so, what we'll be given is a quiz. This is Grunty's quiz show. And we'll be asked a whole bunch of things about... There's a Jinjo. What color is he? That's blue. Um... But, um, we'll be asked a whole bunch of qu uh, questions, like you just saw, about the game, and we'll see how this goes. See the picture on the screen? Do you know where you have been? Um, yeah. Uh, freeze easy peek. <laughs> um, actually with these questions, I can get pretty good. Uh, with these witch questions, uh, it would actually be bad. Be should have actually talked to Brintilda, and I forgot to. <laughs> Oops. Oh well. I can I can completely avoid those. It's like like you're spinning fast, but it's tough for you to get past. Okay, merry go round, routine bones, routine saw blades. That was it. Um. So we can actually go to the Joker, the Joker banjo, uh, tab, and actually that's probably our best. Hold on. Okay. Extra, <laughs> extra money, extra honeycomb piece. <laughs> but um, these are actually going to be our best, our best bets uh, to win this game. See so your picture on my screen. Do you know where you have been? Yep. Uh, Gumby Valley. See, like with these uh, picture thing, picture parts of the uh, the quiz, I am really good at those. Um, so it's a picture on the screen. Do you know where you've been? Yep. Click Lockwood. See, it was either Click Lockwood or uh, Free Easy Peak, and I was almost positive I didn't know which it was. Is Leaking Bucket's name? Uh, Leaky. <laughs> that one's pretty obvious. So now with these little uh, timers, you actually are given a. You're given a, um, uh, what's it called? You're given a challenge and you have to, and you have to win. That's pretty much it. Oh crap. Crap. And I need this. I'm, I may lose. I honestly may lose. Crap. I need to get into a rhythm. And the rhythm's not coming. Rhythm's not coming. He's way ahead of me. He's really ahead. Oh, so it keeps changing right before I get there. I swear, if that one had had, come on, red, 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 red. Oh no, it was yellow. That's bull I call shenanigans. I can actually catch up. I can actually catch up. Oh my god. I'm catching up. I think I've beaten him. 
Oh my god, I won. How the hell did I win? I don't know that. I I I don't know. <laughs> I'm I'm actually speechless. Speechless. Uh, yellow frog, red frog, green frog. Okay, yeah, I had no idea what she was talking about. Um, wow, I'm honestly shocked. Oh. This one will be... This one's gonna be no problem. Just, just hang out here for a little while. So, you know, go get some, uh... <laughs> oh, it was, no, it was just kill them all. I thought it was survive the onslaught. Character from the game, do you know the dumb thing's name? Yeah, I named an episode after him. He should be happy. <laughs> Rob Nut, Grab Nut. <laughs> These names are funny. Uh, oh, yes, yeah, so we can get a Joker card. Freezy Bear is rather sad. You can find to make them glad. Presents. That that's what makes every child happy, you know. And. Oh, music note, yay! Let's see what we're from. Um. Do, do, ba, ba, do, ba, do. Uh, Clinker's Cavern? Okay. <laughs> I was like, this is really familiar. I'm gonna try to. Try to get past those. Um, I don't want to take Gorilla Throw oranges. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't want to take on those grunny, grunny pads. I think I may have to. Click clock wood, a big dark grew, big oak grew. Uh, which one of these ones? That's true. These are largest in summer. This grows outside in winter. Okay. And let's try another banjo. In click clock wood, the shaman's dumb. What useless creature do you become? A bumblebee. A snail! That would be awesome. That would be awesome. Alright, so these are instant death if you get them wrong. I don't want to try. Um, oh boy. Oh boy. I may... Yeah, I'm going to have to take some of these granny questions. Granny's cute. She's been... She's quite a dame. What's my first boyfriend's name? Um... Undead Ed. Oh, man. Let the lucky streak begin. Boggy Bear, Freezy Clyde. How many Jigsaw has he got? Three. He's actually got three. I think he has the most of any character in the game. Uh, see the picture on my screen. Do you know where you have been? Yep. The, uh, the hellhole that is Rusty Bucket Bay. Now, I'm sorry, I don't really have much... No. No! I can't believe I wasted that. I can't believe I wasted that. Which character has this dumb voice? A Jinjo? What else to the Jinjo? Yes. Okay. I can't believe I used up that Joker. I really wish I was thinner. What does Granny like for dinner? Uh, maggot pie? Nope. Well, there goes my lucky streak. I'll use that as a heal. No, stop doing that! I keep hitting X. Make your choice. Which character has this dumb voice? Snorkel. I keep using that. Dumb. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. That I've, that I've used up the cards like that. Village in the middle, which tall object solves this riddle? Total pull, Juju. Anyway, uh, like I was saying earlier, like I was going to say earlier, when I accidentally pressed X, like in like a dumbass. Um, and I'm gonna have to get rid of him first. Um, like a dumbass, I, abs I accidentally hit the wrong button, and I don't remember this, these, uh, I don't remember these things at all. Um, Banjo and Mumbo. 
Banjo, and Banjo. I don't remember any of these combinations. Um, egg. This is Kazooie. What's over here? Kazooie, okay. I know the Jinjos are next to one another in one of the corners. Uh, and that's about it. So, um, like I was going to say earlier before I was an absolute dumbass. And, uh, and uh, messed up by pressing X instead of A. I was going to say I am. I will apologize for uh, the lack of commentary or proper commentary, I should say, in this uh, video. Um, honestly, this is the one part that I actually have to concentrate on during this game. Um, so I just got to really concentrate. <sighs> Sorry about that. I had a good drink. I was getting parched. Um, this is honestly the f one part of the game that I really have to. Has this dumb voice? Oh, um. Uh, Ruby. Yep. But anyway, uh, this is actually the part of. I, this is the part of the game that I actually have to. Um, that I have to. Freezes be. That I have to concentrate on. Because sometimes I don't. Nope, not gonna die. I may have where you've been while well, this isn't seen. Toll seven? Yes! Whew. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I had no idea. Um, there's a Joker all the way over there, but I don't wanna have to. Is that the last? Yeah, that's the last Joker, so I'm gonna have to take on one of these death. One of these death questions. See the picture on my screen? Do you know where you've been? Uh, yeah, Rusty Bucket Bay. Uh, but this is actually the... Like, I've been trying to say, like, five times now. This is the one part of the Let's Play that I will... Oh, hey! Here's the boss fight that we didn't get to take on. So you know what? This is how he's actually supposed to work. This is how he's supposed to work. And he's supposed to break up, as you can see. So this is perfect. And this is how I would have taken him on if I had not uh, glitched the shit out of him. Done. Done. Nothing. He's got nothing. But anyway, uh, the rusty bucket is a tanker, but stuck underneath its anchor. Oh, Snorkel's the... A dumb dolphin. <laughs> I was gonna say snorkel. Alright, so let's leave it as a nail biter, shall we? Do you know and can you tell what on earth was my favorite smell? Um Uh Putrid Parapute? Oh my gosh! Oh Um so here's the real nail biter. Let's Let's try it, shall we? Clinker's the whale stuck down in the goo. In Clinker's cavern, what does he do? He's your garbage grinder. That was an easy one. <laughs> and we have completed the we have completed the board. No one can win, I was assured, by the makers of this board. It's not fair, I want to win. How I long to be real thin. Now you can take the prize on show. While up the winding stairs I go. You won't catch me, I've made sure. All the credits you will now endure. Well, at least we ended off with a nice little couplet. <laughs> Which prize shall we take, Kazooie? Yes. Um, so, we have finally, finally met our goal of getting 2D. So, um,. I guess this is this will be a good time as any to actually provide some proper commentary. <laughs> um, so anyway, um, I hope you guys are enjoying uh, what's it called uh, Kirby 64 and the Crystal Shards. Um, this is my chief ideas, Greg Grunny Mayers. Oh, Miles or whatever she said. I'm sitting at a distance, so I can't read it very well. I'm honestly surprised that I even got to that I even correctly read any of Grunty's dialogue. Anyway, um, 
this is the character credit screen and we will uh, this is well actually they kind of this is uh, I don't think they do this in banjo Tui. I think it's a separate list of uh, credit uh, and uh, I'm not too sure. Anyway, uh, in this, in uh, Banjo Kazooie, I guess it's uh, not only a character parade, as they have dubbed in uh, Banjo Tooie, but also the credits uh, for all the creators of the game. Um, so you you can look upon this, and Brintilda, you serve no purpose. I am sorry. Uh, but you can look upon this and see all the people who have left Rare because of the uh, shit that they're producing for Microsoft. Because Microsoft does not let them do their own thing like Nintendo did. I'm sorry, Rare. You have turned into a piece of shit. <laughs> Which means that they'll probably never make another Banjo-Kazooie game ever again. Sad, but probably very, very true truth um anyway uh i hope i hope you guys have enjoyed this let's play so far um really uh after this crap uh after this uh character parade well you know this is the reason why i like this character parade is because you get to remember all the people that we've met on the way and i know it while i was taking on click lockwood i said it was my favorite but um really thinking about it I gotta say, Freeze Easy Peak is definitely, definitely my favorite of all the levels I could honestly play. If there's one Banjo Kazooie level that I could play over and over and over and over again and explore to death, and that is that would be um, Freeze Easy Peak. So it's got to be my favorite for this uh, for this game. However, for um, for a close second, a very, very close second, I would say Click Lock Wood is my second favorite. But only... But Freezy Peak just nudges out, just in front. Anyway. Um, <laughs> Lago. Wait, isn't he the uh, computer's name in the third game? Or, well, in Nuts and Bolts. Isn't that Lago? Not too sure. Anyway, <laughs> you went from being a toilet to a computer. Hmm, <laughs> that's interesting. Anyway, um, I hope you guys are, <laughs> to go back to what I was saying earlier, I hope you guys are enjoying Kirby 64 and the Crystal Shards. Um, I'm I'm just so glad that I was, uh, that I'm actually able to bring you guys that game. I absolutely love that game. Um, as I love this game, and uh, I'm, from what I've seen, a lot of you love this game as well, and uh, for really good reason, as this is being one of the best games ever made, uh, platformer-wise. Um, so it seems that we are reaching the end of the character parade, and um, we'll do a couple, a couple little extra things, and then I guess we'll go fight Grunty. Well, not, we'll leave her to the end of the, we'll leave her till next episode. But, uh, wait a minute. Did we just go in a circle? No. Rare big cheeses. I thought we went into a circle because I saw a 2D and then Jinjo again. And, huh, I hope... We do not go into a circle. Uh, game Studio. Oh, Microsoft Game Studios. Pick and mix. Oh. The credits on this version are a lot longer than the N64 version. Did not realize that. Um, so. We should be reaching the end very soon. Um, Ken Lobb. <laughs> um. So, we're going to sit through the uh, the character parade a second time, I guess. 
I've actually never beaten this. Hold on. I have beaten this game, but I kind of pressed A so I could skip the uh, the credits. So I think we'll actually. Uh, I think we'll get through this. I think it won't be that long. At least I hope not. Um, but anyway, um, no, we really don't care about these. Ugh, we don't care about these Microsoft people. Free playing cheese, Mac. Oh, that's... Hmm. Cat herders. <laughs> Cat herders. What? You know what? I actually might just want to read the keep reading this just to see what other crazy shit show up. More bean counters. Ah, <laughs> oh, rare. At least, at least you guys kept your humor. Dream makers. And now they lost their flair. No, it's kidding. Um, press hypnotist. What? Are they just making up names now? DMC free players with a cheese topping. What? What is going on? I don't understand. Um, you know, if this gets up to like 22 minutes, I'm gonna stop this because the last episode got into got up into 30 minutes, and I would like to apologize for that. Um, I actually didn't think the SNS, the stop and swap, or SNS if you prefer, would actually take that long. And it ended up taking a good long time, which it could have been a video within itself, but well, um, let's just see how long this will go for. Microsoft, Banjo Kazooie, the Microsoft Game Studios, Logo, Rare, the Rare Logo, Xbox, it's not just 60, it's online, <laughs> the Xbox Logo, sorry, so, um, the Microsoft Group. Of companies. <laughs> okay, there we go. We finished, and here is the uh, the grill, the cookout, just in time for the summer. Yes. Hey, is hey that's Banjo's <laughs> that's Banjo's fish in his fish bowl. They're grilling. <laughs> ah, poor son of a bitch. Anyway, um. <sighs> Hey, isn't that the same radio that they they're sitting next to in uh, nuts and bolts? Anyway, okay. Here comes the part. Here's the party pooper, bitch. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> I'm not going. Ouch! Yes, you are. Let's go. How come the? How come the? Oh, whatever. Okay, we are back finally hey you know what I guess I'll just leave it here for now this has been banjo kazooie and we will be back next episode and we will take on the witch and um, unfortunately this is the only this is like the one area in the game that you really don't that you're here and gone in such a short time I think they should have done something more with this where this world or this uh, this place maybe this was supposed to be where Mount Fire Eyes was supposed to be well maybe maybe not don't know uh, can't can't be bothered to speculate anyway uh, next episode we will take on the witch and finish the game so hope you all have enjoyed this this episode and I hope you guys look forward to next episode when we take on the witch so thank you all for watching, and to take a page from my good friend, Blue Blazing Demon, rate, comment, subscribe, do all the good stuff, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. So, see you guys later. And this is Helfinator, signing off. See ya.